that son? What's he look like? Well, he was pink. Caucasian? No, pink. And big, you say? Yeah, like a big marshmallow. Now, what'd he do? He made me and my friend play this game, Avalanche, and he dumped all these little blobs on me. And the only way that I could survive was if I buried my buddy in boulders. Now, look, he's a cutie. He's just a guy. Commercials. Today, they're all over the place. You can't spend 10 minutes online without running into someone trying to sell you their picture of a monkey. Hey guys, it's me, flying gorilla. TV advertising is no different. Although today's ad breaks may be boring and bland, television advertising of the past was truly a thing to behold. Which is why today, I'm going to be taking a look back into the strange era of TV advertising by watching the art that is old Nintendo commercials. Oh, these are pretty cool bananas. <laughs> Art is subjective. You can't judge me. The Mario franchise is iconic for its upbeat music, incredible level design, and its feel-good personality. Now I don't know about you, but I'd love to get a piece of that personality, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Surely Nintendo would put careful care and consideration into how they portray this lovable franchise being as profitable as it is. Let's see this 1983 Mario Bros. commercial for Atari. Something's coming up the plumbing for Luigi's in a bite of giant turtles out the ah! Oh, okay, time out. Time out. What is that? Is that supposed to be a turtle? Is that supposed to be a Koopa? A Koopa Troopa? Is that supposed to be them? Is that supposed to be these guys? I don't know about you, but he looks more like a crack addict than a turtle in a kid's game. It's Atari Mario Brothers with Mario from Donkey Kong, his brother Luigi, and lots of crazy creatures. And it's twice the fun when two play at once, because you need all the help you can get. Mario, where are you? Mario Brothers, new from Atari. Okay, not gonna lie, that was pretty solid. Like, it was clear, informative, like it was an actual commercial. Like, as a kid, I could totally find this appealing. Aside from Uncle Roy after a stay in the shrimp <laughs> shack. <laughs> yeah, it's actually, like, really funny story. Uh, we're, we're not actually related. At all. And that was just the start of the playlist I got here. It can only get better, right? We are Nintendo Ultimate TV Game System. <laughs> well, I've got a challenge for you, Mr. Nintendo. Try me. You cannot beat us. You cannot beat us. We are Nintendo. You cannot beat us. Nope. That's it. You heard him. You can't beat them. You cannot hide from them. You cannot escape them. They will hunt you down. There is nothing you can do to stop their ravenous rampage. All you can do is run. This is Mario Land 2, Yoshi's Island, starring this guy, uh, Yoshi. What you know? When is too much, too much? To find out, we crammed oh. everything into Super Mario World 2, Yoshi's Island. 60 more levels. Everything into Super Mario World. Huge Yoshi tricks, all served up with the latest graphic technology, Morphmation. Mm -hmm. Sure, you don't have room for another little bonus level? No, no, no. So to advertise a kid-friendly game about Barney the Dinosaur, it proceeds to show a very graphic shot of a man's stomach rupturing, exploding organs all over the camera, and several bystanders.
He wasn't like other men. His loving personality and endless generosity made him stand out from all the rest. One could never forget that beautiful smile of his. His pockets were empty, but his heart was full. Very full. Do you like Kirby? He's this guy. Th th this guy right here. Do you like Kirby? I like Kirby. Let's watch him Kirby. Muffin is a half tabby, half calico who loves giving kitten kisses. Buddy is part lab, part husky, and he chases balls. Kirby is part fire, part bomb, spike, and lightning, and he loves to combine these in new ways to destroy his enemies. Ah, oh, yes. Here we have a cute kitten, a puppy, and over here is Dark Wizard Balthazar, the omnipotent gladiator of the Nether Realms. I may not look like it, but this guy over here, he's packing some serious artillery on him. Best be wary. Enemy. So, we have three one. Oh my gosh, Kirby! It was just a joke! It was just a goof! What have you done? You just obliterated him! <sighs> you monster! You sick, twisted monster! <laughs> Two wonderful pets to choose from. Kirby 64. Rated E for everyone. Rated... Rated E for everyone. Rated... Rated E for everyone? Okay, okay, let's think. There's gotta be at least one game that hasn't been absolutely slandered by old advertising. Wait, no, I got it, I got it. The Legend of Zelda, elven warrior in a mythical world full of vicious monsters. Even the oldest games in the series are full of intense battles and epic fights. All right, let's see this one over the Ocarina of Time. Why... why does it say that? Okay. That was good. Compared to the other videos, that was great even. I mean, sure, I could have gotten better video quality from streaming Netflix from my microwave, but it was good. That's it. My quest is finally over. I can finally die peacefully knowing that at least one Nintendo game has been completely slandered by commercial advertising. I feel happy. I feel at peace. Wait. Sorry, what? Is that, is that, is that rapping? Wait. No. No. It can't be. No. 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 The fact never cut the slack, and I always watch my back for Jack. Took the barrel. Zelda. Let's see if you can see the new world.